So you stay over there and you like it. That's right. That's what I tell cannon shooters. Maybe. Anyway, Jared, JaredPolin.com, Fronosphoto.com. I'm going to do something I don't normally do. We're going to talk about Canon today. I'm at Alan's camera. It's letting me play with all the good toys and all the new stuff that came in. So, just got in 70 to 200 28 IS2 ultrasonic lenses. I'm told that these are really expensive, more expensive than the Nikon. Um, and they're telling me that it's sharper. I haven't done much research on it because I don't have it. Now, that is one thing that is amazing about the Canon glass. It, it has always been great, uh, except for when they put out version 2s really quick, like 16 to 35, and then 16 to 35 version 2. Nobody liked the first one, so then they put the second one out. But in the 70 to 200 range, they've always been the best pieces of glass. It's probably better than the Nikon, which it is what it is, but I, nobody cares. It's what you do with it. But these, they, they've always made awesome glass. They make that 85-1-2, which is awesome. Um, 85-1-2 on a video or on any camera is amazing. It's just a hunk of glass. But let's open this up, unbox it, see what we got. As I haven't unboxed a Canon yet. Info book in many languages. Warranty card. Styrofoam smells like uh, the inside of a Lowe's. Definitely put that in there pretty good. Um. <clears throat> anyway, here we go. We have a plastic bag, and then not even a full plastic bag anymore, just this chamois thing that they put in there. I don't know why it's just a chamois thing. Nice little case. We'll never use it for anything. More styrofoam. Ooh, it's a new O shape. O. It used to be just a half O. I don't know what they're thinking. Hey, they give you a lens hood. Back in the day, they didn't give you a lens hood. And I wonder if their lens hoods will stand up opposed to Nikon's, because in the 7200 on the Nikon, it doesn't stand up anymore, which is very, very frustrating. So let's take it out of its plastic bag and give it the, the good old sniff test. And then you're gonna have to turn the head Ooh. so the song is up again. Whew. And then you come back this way. Alright, this is what I think it's like. Up. I think it smells like uh, the, is a little, uh, the inside of Oscar the Grouch's trash can. Yeah, inside of Oscar the Grouch's trash can. Alright, so the lens seems to feel about the same as the older ones. You have different stabilization modes on the side, one, two, manual, autofocus. The same stuff. It's basically the same outer design. Um, same 77, same crappy lens uh, crappy uh, lens cap that they've been giving. They should go to what Nikon goes with and, and use the squeeze in the middle because these just stink. But this is a, a hell of a nice piece of glass. It seems to be a little lighter than what the Nikon is. Um, one thing I like differently on the Nikon is you can take off the shoe. I'm sure this comes off uh, but the Nikon just slides right off and boom, you're done with it. But other than that, I'm sure it's a really awesome lens. And um, that's it. That's a 70 to 200 version 2 from Canon 2.8. Really expensive, 24, 2500 bucks. He's got them here, Alan's camera. You want one, give him a call. He'll ship them out to you. All right. Oscar the Grouch is checking out.